I remember when I was a student at the University of Georgia and Dr. Larry Marchington, I mean just a giant pillar in the deer world, was my major professor. He was telling me when he was a graduate student, of course, we're talking decades ago now, he was actually the first guy to ever put a radio collar, long before GPS, on a white-tailed deer. He was so proud, had one collar, I think, and he was tracking, you know, he kind of followed signal, this eight-point buck through the woods in Alabama. All of a sudden, the signal went dead, and he went up there and, you know, figured out what happened, and a bobcat had killed this mature eight-point buck. Well, at the time, I thought, man, I don't know if I believe that or not. But through the years, I've certainly learned that bobcats, you know, they're not big, 15, 20 pounds. Everyone talks about 50-pound cats. I doubt that's ever true could take down an adult white-tailed deer. Well, really recently, a really good friend of mine, Mike, in South Dakota, just shared a trail camera picture with me, and it's of a cat coming down on a mature white-tailed deer. I think this cat may have missed because it's on the rear end of the deer, and normally cats, of course, go for the neck, go for the jugular. Hey, I'm not saying cats kill mature deer every day, bobcats, but they certainly are a factor in the predation of white-tailed deer. Take that one step further, my same buddy in eastern South Dakota shared with me some pictures of a mountain lion on his property. And I gotta tell you, I get people sending me pictures of mountain lions all the time. They're usually a dog or a house cat or you know, a bobcat, a lot of bobcats. This is clearly a mountain lion. Bobcats are certainly a deer predator, although I believe their take on adult deer is probably pretty minimal. I'd worry more about coyotes taking deer but mountain lions, they were built specifically to take deer. And if you hunt in an area that has a lot of mountain lions, that's going to be out west, not, you know, Virginia or somewhere like that. You can bet they're taking their fair share of the game in that area.